CERN is where science meets magic, meets religion, meets Satanism. Oof. You would think an elite would would state uh, or an elite owned state of the art uh, science facility would worship statues of atoms or dance around strands of DNA, which makes sense. It makes complete sense. Or dance around strands of DNA, you know, uh, statues of atoms because it's to do with science and all of this stuff. But no, they worship Shiva, god of destruction, and Baphomet, which is the satanic or satanist god of transgender. Why do you think that this is? This is satanic to say the least. Okay, let's watch the video from the beginning of what's being posted. I mean, I can't believe my eyes. If you know anything about CERN, comment a massive long, literally a long, as long as possible, explaining what CERN is, what goes on in CERN in the comment section down below right now. All right, but let's watch this from the beginning anyways. What on earth, man? What the? The GOAT, the greatest of all time, right? It's garbage. This is, the world is finished. Guys, look, all I've been saying for the longest of time, they're preparing us to usher in the GOAT, Satan, which Baphomet is depicted as literally the goat with breast up here and male parts. Okay, it's transgender, hence that, that comment that I just read. They're preparing us because one time, very, very soon, in the near future, in the future, distant future, it's going to be well since we're now all used to saying the word goat, great, which stands for greatest of all time. When if you read your Bible, you'll realize that no, 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 Satanist. They worship Buffalo Met, which is a goat headed god. That's where that stems from. Whenever you see something trend worldwide, such as the word goat, yeah, he's the greatest of all time. Goat, 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 goat. Just know it's not by accident. Things don't just happen by accident anymore. It's not a coincidence or anything like that. This way, the more people are used to saying goat, goat, greatest of all time, associating themselves with goat. I'm the goat. I'm the goat of this. I'm the greatest of all time. Now imagine they present to us, oh, this just happens to be a world leader who has, you know, all of a sudden there's peace in Israel, peace in Gaza, all of this mid Middle Eastern places or wherever there's war. He's just solving everything like he's just got the solution for everything. And everyone's like, well, since he's got the solution for everything, don't you think it's going to be a good idea for us to worship him? Why not? I mean, he is, quote unquote, the greatest of all time, right? I mean, he solved what Elon Musk couldn't solve, Donald Trump, Joe Biden, all of these presidential heads, every, he, I mean, he's done it all. So he technically is the greatest of all time. Okay, GOAT, so, and this is him. Since everybody's calling me the greatest of all time, I guess I am the GOAT. Why don't you all just worship me? You know what? The best idea, why don't we all just have a one world religion where we just, there's, there's no like, you know, there's no God of the Bible. There's no, there's just one God and we all just worship the same God. This way, all the Satanists, the Muslims, the Christians can all worship one God. Uh, I got a better idea. What, why don't we make that God me since I'm the greatest of all time? I mean, I did solve everything. And no, you know what I mean? No. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm telling you the rest of the world is going to buy this up, scoop it up like like nothing the digital currency look guys i can go on and on and on and on let me know in the comment section what do you think cern is what and if you don't know google it man don't be lazy look you're google away you're a youtube search away to finding out what cern is what goes on there but i'm telling you what you're going to come across is pure evil do not be shocked ronnie mp told you here first but i pray that ah, I wanted to move that back. I pray that the Lord gives you the discernment, the wisdom to be able to see the truth in plain sight because that's what Satanists do. They put the truth in your in your face and they pray that you don't see it. This way, they dodge karmic retribu retribution. They believe in karmic retribution, meaning that if they tell you that they're about to do something and then they do it, it's the blood is not on their hand, it's on your hand because I told you smoking kills. You decided to smoke. 10 years, 15 years, 50 years later, you have 
lung cancer and you're dying on your deathbed well we did say smoking kills on the packet you smoked it therefore it's your fault it's not our fault that's exactly what satanists do so they blast things out in the simpsons they put things in your face and then when it happens it's like oh my days the simpsons predicted it is no 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 it's planned it's planned but they, they just feel like if they tell you in advance that they're about to do something subliminally, then the fault is not their own. But in the end, Christ will judge everything. Why? Because God is a just God. He is a just God and he's going to give people what they deserve. Okay, so Christ sees the heart. He doesn't see what people say. He sees your intentions. He sees your heart. So I pray that you turn to him. I pray that you literally say, you know what? I am just a normal human. I do not know. I put my faith and trust in God in the one who created me. And I promise you the world, the Lord is going to st stand by you and the world will witness the glory of God through your life. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. Smash the like button. Comment something important. And uh, obviously, subscribe if you want to. All right. Link in the description will lead you to somewhere that's probably going to change your life. The link in the description. All right.